What drew me to teaching music is my love of performance. I love playing music. Kevin and I are both still an active performers in the Trello community, and I, I love being able to kind of provide those opportunities for kids, so whether it's school plays or choirs and bands or some more unique experiences. I find it really rewarding to be able to kind of cultivate those experiences and, and then see what students are able to get out of them. What drew me to teaching music was that I grew up in a really musical family. My dad from a young age was always playing music around the house. In addition to that, I always just really related very well to my music teachers and sort of the collaboration and the, the community that was built around that was always a really special part of my life growing up. And so I wanted to kind of share that with other people. One of the things that I think is really unique about teaching music to young people is the opportunity to make connections. And I think specifically at an age where you're really looking to kind of build connections with people, it gives you a really unique sort of profound way to communicate and a way to sort of uniquely express yourself. I really like teaching music to young people because it's an opportunity to get them to try something completely new. And it's such a wonderful privilege to be able to hand someone like a trumpet for the first time and get them buzzing their lips. Evan and I are both privileged to be able to teach these kids in grade seven. And if things kind of go well for both parties, you teach them until they're in grade 12. To be able to be there at the beginning and then also help them with their auditions and, and do every step of the way, it's just really rewarding. Technology has been a really interesting uh, addition to how we taught music. When I first started, I taught in a fairly traditional straight ahead concert band way where we had our instruments and we learned to read notes. And I found some ways to use technology to really augment that program. I think it's very important to me that music literacy is still kind of central to what we do. Some interesting ways in which that I've, I've been able to incorporate technology into it uh, has been with multi-track recording. I think particularly in the vocal program, uh, to set kids up with some USB microphones and some multi-track recording software uh, is a really unique way to take music from being something that just happens in the moment and it's gone and to have it be something that can go with them and it can go home to parents and go to the wider community and be something that students are really proud of. When you record yourself and you listen back to it, it becomes so immediately evident what you've done wrong and what you need to fix. And so using recordings in that way to allow you to analyze and reflect upon your own work um, and your own growth and what sort of where you're headed is really important and really valuable, I think. Teaching music is one of the most exciting things. I just love it so much. And I feel like being able to share that with other people is one of the greatest privileges of my life.